to go to for the how to you know that you want to get beautiful prince Hi Primpers, welcome to another 5 things I'm loving this week. Once again, I have some seriously fun uh, new beauty products for you and I'm just looking at them now and they're actually all makeup this week, which I haven't had for quite some time. Anyway, coming in at number 5 is the new limited edition Longcom Hypnose Drama Mascara. Now, this is a part of their Noir Pearls collection and I'm already a huge fan of the Hypnose Drama Mascara, um, but the Noir Pearls is all about black. That's kind of the theme of the range. And this is Blackest Black, which obviously is a very dark, dark mascara, which I personally love. The darker, the better when it comes to my lashes. Um, it's $52. And what is so exciting about this mascara is if you have downloaded your lookbook yet, or even better, gone into David Jones to get the hard copy, you'll notice that there's a little tab on the side of the contents page, which allows you guys to go in and actually experience the whole range and get a free sample. Um, of this mascara so I thought I should definitely talk about it today because um, you know you get to try one for free so that's always a winner and it's actually a really really good mascara I love it so um, that's my pick for number five this week Coming in at number four is a new mineral powder foundation from Alme, and it's completely free of talc, parabens, oil, and fragrance, which is great for anyone with sensitive skin or skin with issues like psoriasis or dermatitis or um, eczema, whatever it might be. So um, it's great for those kind of things and also great just for everyone, really. It's kind of nice just to give your skin a little bit of a break and use something that's got nothing that could possibly clog your pores in it. So this is their new Alme Wake Up um, Hydrating Makeup. And even though it's a powder, it kind of finishes with a little bit of a wet look almost so that you get that beautiful dewy finish that you want in a liquid foundation, but it's a powder. So um, it comes with a little inbuilt brush, but you know, you can either use your own kabuki brush if you like. Um, but it's really funky packaging, so you kind of just flick that off, there's your brush and you dip it in the powder and you're good to go. So anyway, that's a fun new mineral makeup. I know how much you all love mineral makeup and it's $29.95 and available now. Coming in at number three this week is the new Suede Rhapsody collection from Revlon. Now there's heaps of products in the collection that Gucci Westman, one of the world's most amazing makeup artists, created. Um, but there's a couple that I'm going to show you today. Now one of them is this amazing eyeshadow quad. And when I was in New York recently, I was kind of alerted to the fact that green is massive in terms of trends this year and you know you might see a palette like that and think oh I don't know about that green but honestly it's so wearable you can just wear it a little bit wet and use it as a liner or if you're brave go all out with the eyeshadow and then just blend it in with the other colors just to give you kind of underneath a little bit of green coming through rather than just having the one kind of green color you know that's how you can work it in there's a beautiful plum up there like a silvery gunmetal oh I absolutely love this. So this is the Colorstay 12-hour um, eyeshadow, and it's in Silver Fox. So that's a part of the collection. There's also this really funky multi-use palette, and it's got cheeks, it's got lips, it's got eyes, it's got everything in there that you could possibly imagine. And the colors are also really fun. Notice the peach there. You know how massive peach is this season, so I'm loving, loving that. And finally, there's the nail polishes, and it's called Matte Suede. Even though it's not matte, it's actually quite metallic. And this is a really cool green color. It's called Emerald City. And they're all a part of the new collection, but there's lots of lipsticks. There's other colors of nail polish. It's all super, super fun. And let's see, like the nail polish is $13.95. The eyeshadow is $25.95, so it's all really well priced. And that funky little limited edition multi-use palette is only $19.95 as well. So you can go out there and have some fun with your makeup. And that is my pick for number three this week. Coming in at number two is this beautiful new lipstick from Chanel. Here they are. There's 25 shades in this collection called Rouge Coco Shine, and it's all about giving you lips that are beautifully shiny and sheer and glossy and hydrated with your lipstick. Now, these are two of my favorite colors. This is Liberté, which is oh, this heaven kind of peach color that we all love. We all know that peach makeup is massively on trend at the moment. And then there's this one, which is this beautiful, like, 
reddy kind of pink, which I love, and that's called Monte Carlo. Um, but as I said, there's 25 new colours in this collection, and if you kind of want the colour of a lipstick but still that hydrating kind of component of lip balm, then I think that this might be your new favourite lipstick. It's really, really beautiful. Um, and it's 50 bucks for the lipstick. Coming in at number one is... Um, so, so cool. I love this collection so much and it's the new MAC Wonder Woman collection. And when I was in New York recently as well, I saw the MAC store on, I think it was Fifth Avenue, there was one down in Soho and their whole window was decked out in Wonder Woman. It was amazing. It was so, so cool. And we're lucky to now have the range here. Let me just check. It's, yep, it's already in store March. So this, like seriously, look at that packaging. It's just beyond. This is their mineralized skin finish. Check out the packaging. And then inside, it's like this amazing, amazing bronzer. So, so good. Love that. Let me tell you how much that is. Um, bear with me for one second. Okay, $58 for the bronzer. There's lipsticks. Oh, my God, I'm dying. And beautiful. This is like a, the perfect nude lippy. So, so good. They're $37. Love that. And then there's even a mascara. Oh my God, the Wonder Woman mascara, which is, let's see, the Oculash, $32. But guys, can you imagine like whipping these out whenever you're applying your makeup? It's just so cool. I grew up with Wonder Woman um, and it's a little bit awesome. So there's more to the collection, but they were kind of just three things that I wanted to show you my three favorite things from the collection. The packaging gets me every time, but we all know that... Um, MAC products definitely don't fail um, in terms of application and what they're giving you inside the product. So you're inside the packaging. So it's all really exciting this week, guys. Um, they're my five things for the week. Let me know what you think of them. Let me know if there's anything that you've seen this week that you love and you want to share with everyone else out there. Um, otherwise, I'll see you all next week with some more Primped Fun. Bye.